Not every public person is able to admit it when his personal life collapses, and even more so, to tell others about infidelity. The story of Princess Diana was a shock to the whole world. It is still a mystery how this beautiful woman endured her husband's affairs for so long, knowing about them. After all, she was able to earn the absolute love of her countrymen and the rest of the world, but she could not earn it from her husband. The story began beautifully, and Diana seemed like a perfect match for the prince. A modest girl with aristocratic roots, after studying in private schools, worked as an assistant teacher in a kindergarten. This option suited the queen very much, but Charles himself was attracted to girls of a completely different type. He had long been infatuated with Camilla Rosemary Shand, but she was categorically rejected by the monarch. Elizabeth's son was initially drawn not to Diana, but to her older sister Sarah. A fling quickly turned into a full-fledged relationship, and others predicted an early wedding for the couple. The problem was that the girl did not understand the seriousness of the situation because she did not care who she would get married to and what would follow. In the palace, such an attitude was perceived as an insult, and their relationship ended quickly. And then Diana caught the prince's eye. It all started from the moment when Prince Philip, looking at his son's previous relationships, decided to protect the honor of the innocent girl and demanded seriousness. The obedient son did not disobey and got engaged very quickly, and Diana received a ring with a huge sapphire and 14 diamonds. The people close to them were sure that the bride was delighted with the position, but later Diana admitted that she felt cornered at the moment when she walked down the aisle. She claimed that at the time she had no idea about the groom's relationship with Camilla. Skeptics wonder how it was possible to be unaware about what the press was buzzing about all the time. Perhaps she simply hoped to outshine her rival, despite the fact that Charles was never afraid to offend her and directly pointed out the flaws he didn't like. And there was no moral support from him. He did not consider it necessary to help his future wife cope with loneliness and depression and simply lived his life. And Diana had to cope alone with the paparazzi attacks who literally did not leave her alone and were outside her windows all the time. On the eve of the upcoming wedding, a confused girl found a bracelet from the groom, which he planned to give to his mistress. The prince openly ignored the bride, but he ran to his mistress at her first call. And all this was happening in front of others, despite the upcoming celebration and Camilla's marital status. It was clear to everyone that Charles needed this marriage in order to please his mother. And the timid Diana still hoped to impress her husband, despite the fact that they spent very little time together. The prince simply did not consider it necessary to make any steps toward her. The situation had led to Lady Diana's difficult state of mind. She was tormented by bouts of bulimia in addition to severe depression caused by obsessive thoughts about her husband's infidelities. She tormented him with jealousy and suspicion, which greatly annoyed Charles, although it was fully justified. It was at that time that Diana had her first thoughts about suicide. The situation didn't improve after their first child was born, but after the birth of their second son, there was some warmth in the couple's relationship. But Diana plunged into motherhood with such zeal that she completely ceased to be interested in her husband, thus pushing him to resume his relationship with Camilla. In that situation, a huge sense of duty prevented Diana from filing for divorce. In the royal family, divorce was considered a disgrace for the whole family, and the fear of losing children played a role, because after the divorce, there was a high probability that the boys would stay with their father, and she definitely could not let that happen. By this time, the lack of communication with her husband, Lady Diana replaced with extensive charitable activities. She interacted with organizations around the world, winning their respect. Trying to ignore her painful marriage, Diana started an affair with James Hewitt. The attractive writing instructor was not only into an attentive friend, but also into an ardent lover. This connection helped her survive the setbacks in her relationship with her husband. 
Both spouses no longer hid their lack of interest in each other. However, they were not divorced at the insistence of the queen. Diana herself, having survived the divorce of her parents, did not want to traumatize her children. This bright woman left behind an unforgettable trace. Despite the dubious relationship with her husband, she gave the monarchy two heirs. Diana was successfully engaged in patronage and humanitarian issues and was socially available. The inimitable marry of Charles's wife to present herself turned her into a style icon. A beautiful picture in reality was a golden cage from where a young woman tried to get out with all her might. The marriage with the heir to the throne turned into a real torture for her. Would you be able to tolerate infidelity for so long? If you like the video, leave a like and also subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss anything interesting.